What is up, guys? It's Drugs Angus here to bring you another episode of the Pokemon Sacred Gold Nuzlocke. Last episode, we took on the gym leader, Price, and then we beat the fuck out of Giovanni. And holy crap, we sweep his entire team, and the sound is off. Let me turn that on. My bad, my bad, my bad. Okay, turn it all the way up. Teen light. I don't even like contra music. It's a worse genre. <laughs> Sorry. Um, but anyways, we did a grinding montage, and it's too loud. God bless America. Oh my gosh. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. Okay, let's... 15. No, about 11. There we go. That's good. That's better. Okay, so, last episode, we made the crap out of Giovanni. <sighs> okay, and we sweeped his entire team with Roxy. Which I find to be 100% awesome. You are amazing, Roxy. And the layout is freaked up. Awesome. Just like usual. I was unprepared. Unprepared. Nice and unprepared. Awesome. <laughs> okay, there we go. That, that's good. That's good. So, anyways. In the first slot. Well, in the first thing. I didn't train up Lucario or Roxy because I didn't need to. It was already at the level I wanted everyone else to be. We then have shield off in the second slot. Hold up a second. Sorry, I had to cough right there. But anyways, he has earthquake, iron tail, iron head, and ancient power. We then have arrow the aerodactyl, which has crunch, ancient power, fly, and dragon claw. We then have gray the spiritomb, which has shadow sneak, dark pulse, hypnosis, and dream eater. And last but not least, we have Butte the Milotic, which has Rain Dance, Aqua Tail, Water Pulse, and Surf. And it has too many water type moves, so I'm going to give it Ice Beam right quick. And I'm not breaking the rules at all, you know. I mean, just, you know, just, you know, just let it happen, let it happen, you know. Uh, hey, hey, how's your day going? Alright, awesome. Uh, that, that's pretty cool, you know. That, that's pretty awesome. But, um, so, like, I was thinking, like, uh, God bless America. Hold up a second, I'll be right back. Okay, my bad about that. Uh, I had I had an XP code on because uh, grinding is so much easier with an XP code. Like you guys don't even know, and it makes it a lot easier on me. But anyways, it makes it to where it freezes every time I try to teach a Pokemon a move. So yeah. So the, anyways, this episode I think we're going through the ice cave. Now let me be sure and fly. Oh, by the way, we don't need what's its face in the party anymore because we have Aerodactyl. So, yeah, it knows fly, so we're just gonna fly back to Ecrotique, and I think, I think, I think, I think, I thought I think, I think, I stink, I think that we need to battle all the Kimono Girls in a succession up here. Now, before we do, let's get a lot of stuff, because we're gonna need it, like Hyper Potions and all that. Actually, let's go all out, let's get a Max Potion. Actually, wait a second. Is there like a complete full heal? There is not. Okay, Hyper Potions are next best bet, so I'm gonna get about 50 of them. Because I've always, 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 always had trouble with the Kimono Girls. Like, they are so difficult. But anyways, uh, yep, I think, I think we do. For Kimono Girls like me, dancing is everything. I've never gotten a day without a dance practice. Pokemon are the same. They grow you with you little by little each day. <laughs> okay, so I'm gonna try to make them Korean, but nope, we do not do that. I think we go to the ice cave, so let's make our way over there. Woohoo! All right, I'll just go to it once I do get there. Actually, no, no, I won't do that. Actually, yes, I will do that. I'll see you guys once I get there. Okay, and we're on Route 44. This is gonna be leading up to the ice cave, and I might skip the ice cave because I've heard the ice cave is incredibly boring, and nobody's really had good commentary going through there. So yeah, I don't, I don't think I'm gonna do it. So anyways, I already got my encounter on this route. If you saw in the grinding montage, I got a Remoraid, so I just killed it. <laughs> because uh, let's face it, I have too many water types on this, like for real. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna keep on moving my happy little way. And I did not battle these trainers right here, so I'll go ahead and do that right now. And the XP code is off, I hope, because if it isn't, then oops, oopsies. Um, so I'm gonna use Aura Spear on this, hopefully when it KOs, and it doesn't. Okay, it uses Charge anyway, so it doesn't deal. It doesn't matter. <laughs> it doesn't deal, you know. <laughs> okay, so this is a Blossom. Now we can see Arrow in action. Arrow is amazing. You guys have no clue. Like, I've never used an Aerodactyl before. I did not expect them to be this good. Like, holy crap. Okay, that's an Empoleon. 
so I can just use R spear right quick. Boom! Bop! That is a dead Empoleon. Alright, so I don't think I battled this guy either. Nope, I did not. So let's go ahead and do that. And what do you have, my good sir? Tropius. Uh, how about no? <laughs> um, you. I want you. Oh shit! Oh wait, never mind. <laughs> okay, I was about to have a panic attack. Okay, it's super effective. Awesome. Oh shit! That is a Quagsire. Um, what's super effective? Okay, the only thing that's super effective against Quagsire is grass. But since I don't have a grass type, uh, I'm just going to send in Butte. Okay, Earthquake doesn't do that much. Awesome. Um, Ice Beam. Oh shit, I gotta knock it out quick. Oh, doesn't matter. Butte's gonna fall asleep anyways. Um, shield off. You go, bro. I don't know, it's so hard not to say shield on because, I mean, it's like shield off. It's so close to on. Um, Tropius again. Okay, let's send out Gray. Let's send out Gray. Gray is our new is Spiritomb. I did not even know this guy was... this. Oh shit! I did not even know this little kid was in the game, so that's this is pretty cool to have. Um, oh, oh, baby, a triple. Okay. Um, hyper potion. And oh, okay. Uh, extreme speed. There we go. Awesome. All right. So this is a Charizard. We are not about to put, you know who, up in there. I might go with Arrow because Arrow knows Stone Edge, so that's like times four. Um, or Ancient Power, I mean. Awesome! Wow, one-hit KO, awesome. <laughs> I did not even know that would be a one-hit KO. Oh, for some reason, I found out why the full hills were all up here. Like, these guys, let me find them. These guys right here, I found out why. It's because of the XP code. I have no clue why, but I'm just going to use them anyways, because, I mean, they're here. I'm going to take advantage of it. So, and that, and shield off is going to be fine. It's, it's cool. And so, let's see, what else do we have on this route? We need to battle this guy. This is a bird keeper, I'm pretty sure. Um... Let's see. Yep, and I'll tell. Alright, so I'm not about to let Roxy stay out against this, so let's send an arrow. Y yeah, that's why I switched out. And then Ancient Power. Oh, it tanks it. Wow. Okay, then Crunch. Oh, wow. <laughs> uh, Pidgeot. Uh, let's stay. In. Ancient Power? Awesome. Great. Um, okay, okay. So now. Uh, yeah, sure, whatever. Um, I'm only going to cut in the ice, the place, whenever it's important, the ice path, important. <laughs> I'm only going to cut it in whenever important stuff happens, so I will see you guys, or no, this is going to be sped up, so I will see you guys in a second. Awesome, 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 great! And the first one's down. And the second one's down. And the third one is down. is down. So without further ado, let's keep going in. We are at one of the Kimono Girls. I'm sorry, but I skipped the first few lines because I didn't realize what was happening. But anyways, she's basically stuck in the ground. Um, so, like, basically you need to push her out the way. And you do. But it's no laughing matter when you push me back. Shove. 
Pushing girls is fun. <laughs> you really all kind. Thank you so much. Okay. So, basically, I just got through the whole entire ice cave without messing up on one puzzle. Woohoo! And I'm so happy about that. I'm so proud of myself. Woohoo. And besides the fact that I have all A's and B's in school, you know, I mean, whatever. <laughs> this, this is more important to me. So basically, yep, it's really easy puzzles. They're very easy. So anyways, we are now in the final town, Blackthorn City. What is she going to give me? Well, you came through the ice path. You must be a real hotshot trainer. And she hasn't given me anything. Okay. But anyways, this is our final town. Our Well, before the Elite Four, but whatever. I'm still, like, just in awe <coughs> that we're pretty much on the last episode. Well, we're pretty much, like, three episodes away from finishing it. Have you ever seen Claire's signature Pokemon? It's a wonder to marvel at. I'd love for my horsey to match that Pokemon, but it isn't strong enough. Say, you're a trainer, right? You might find this item more useful than me. The Dragon Scale. That item is said to do something if used on a Seedra. Okay, I guess it evolves it. Ooh. They say that the Pokemon they say that the Pokemon Mart here got a hold of a large shipment of rare evolution stones. Oh what? What that's cool. Okay, what what do you have? There was this move there was this move that I just had to teach my Pokemon. So I got the move deleter to make up for getting a gym move. Okay. So let's go ahead and get our encounter for Blackthorn. I'm pretty sure we can. I don't know, I'm not really sure. Um I, actually, you know what? No, not right there. If I can get a Zangoose, that would be freaking epic right there. That'd be amazing. Alright, so this is Route 45, so we're going to go ahead and get our encounter. But first, we can go ahead and get an encounter for Dark Cave, so let's go ahead and go inside and see what's up. A Wobbuffet. Okay. Wow, they sure does live up to its name. And what do we get? Close my eyes. Oh, what is that? <gasps> a Slugma? No way! No way, no way, no way, no way, no way, no way. I need that. <laughs> okay. Awesome, we're just gonna go ahead and catch it. Oh, come on. Come on. Catch. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. Get in the ball. There we go. Alright. So, I'm gonna name it... Lucy. Because, well, I've been dropping a lot of fairy tale references lately. Gray almost named one of my Pokemon Natsu, and then Lucy. Wow, okay. I don't know why I named it Lucy, I just, I don't know, first thing that popped in the head. But anyways, we're going to go ahead and get an encounter for Route 45. Please be a Dawn fan. Please, for the love of God, be a Dawn fan. Okay, close my eyes, see what it is. Last encounter of the game, pretty much. Oh, I've heard that. I've heard that. Is that a Ponyta or a Rapidash? I, uh, fuck my life. Just fuck it. I can't catch it because it's gonna use freaking explode. Actually, 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 actually. You know what? I'm gonna catch it. I'm gonna catch it. Please do not kill. This is a bad decision. Oh, okay, caught it anyways. So, I'm gonna name it. Um. Ick. Explosion. I know, very original, haha. <laughs> it's probably gonna be death fodder anyways, <laughs> to be honest. But what I'm gonna do is before I battle what's her face, um, I'm going to most definitely look up some things like on her levels because I need to know. Because I'm not about to go in there and get shrecked first first time I go in there, you know? I mean that that's just not happening. Like you know, I'm not just going to go in there and voluntarily Shrek myself, so I most definitely need to check her out, see what she has, and then just go on from there, but I might teach my Pokemon some TMs, and that might be it, and I need to teach Butte um, Dragon Pulse, because uh, I obviously need something to resist Dragon types in there. Um, let's see here. Is there anything else? Anything at all? Uh, nope. That looks like it's it. Oh, Ice Beam. Yeah, I need to teach Ice Beam to more of my Pokemon. Let's see. And, hey! Shield Off is able to learn Ice Beam. I'll take it. That's, 
strange. I'll just put it like that. That is strange. But Shield Off has uncomparable defense to the rest of the team. And that's amazing. And okay, so Iron Header or Iron Tail. That is 100 but has 75% accuracy. This does 80 but has 100% accuracy. Let's get rid of that. But I'm very surprised that Shield Off can learn Ice Beam. That's shocking to say the least. And we're going to teach Dragon Claw to any Pokemon that can. And Arrow is the only one that can. So, that being said, wait, who can learn Hail? Okay, not worth it. Um, but with that being said, I think, uh, actually this episode's pretty short. I'm going to get an encounter for Blackthorn, and that'll do it. That'll do it. Actually, what do you have to say? Claire, our gym leader, is waiting for you. However, it would be impossible for a run of the mill trainer to win. He, really, now. So, actually, I'm going to fight the trainers that are in the gym itself, and then I'm going to dedicate episode 22 to Claire. A fucking magic card. No, do No, species claws. Not an issue. Are we going to get anything? Okay. Yeah, we got some. Alright, close my eyes. Guess what it is? Is that a Magikarp? It is Magikarp. If it's one of those Magikarp only things, like, I don't know. And... Yep, got it. Alright, let's see what we got. Please be a Corpish. And yeah, it's just Magikarp. Oh well. Um, we're gonna go ahead and get an encounter in the thing. I don't know what it's called. Oh, I can't. Never mind. Okay. Alright, so we're just gonna go back to the gym. Yeah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> so we're gonna send out my Lodic, or actually we're gonna send out Butte in the first slot because she is gonna be the main person of this gym. Because you never know. I mean, I just want to be completely safe. Yo, champ in the making. The gym has unstable foot, nigga. Keep your Pokemon in their poke balls, bitch. Now Claire uses the mythical and sacred Dragon type Pokemon. You can't damage them very easily, but you know it's supposed to be weak against Ice type moves. Alright, so that gives us a giant help, and we're gonna do this. I don't get why people had so much trouble with Claire's puzzles. It's like, to me, they were not that hard, as everyone was making them out to be. Not that difficult. So this is a Dratini, and it's about to get Shrekt with Butte. Awesome. Yeah, Butte's gonna be our main dude up in here, or main girl up in here, I'm sorry. Uh, Cedra, okay. Are you weak against... Oh. You are not. Okay, what about Dragon Balls? Okay, that does neutral damage. Nice. Now let's just hope Claire's Seedra isn't uh, isn't gonna be more difficult than that because that was not that difficult. But luckily, Butte resists everything in this gym. I hope if none of them know Thunderbolt, then that'd be amazing. I'm just saying, you know, just nudge, nudge, wink, wink. I really hope none of you know Thunderbolt. That'd be really amazing to know. And you know, we might go ahead and do Claire's gym in this episode. You know, I mean, I think we're ready for it. I'm not really sure though, I haven't looked at the levels yet, I'm just battling all the trainers right now to knock them out, knock them out the way. And Ice Beam, obviously, you know what we bout, uh, Altaria, oh wow, times for effectiveness, get out of here. Alright, nice job, nicely done, nicely done. Okay, and Flygon, we're gonna use Dragon Pulse, see how much it does. Okay, okay, Butte, Butte's pretty strong, I think she can do it, she's a pretty strong independent Milotic. I don't think this is the last row, though. I'm pretty sure it's not. If if it is, then we're going to go ahead and do Claire uh, this episode. Because, I mean... Okay, yep, this is it. That's it. So I'm going to go heal, and I'll be right back. Okay, and we're back. And so earlier today, I'm friends with a Gen 1 -er. Yeah, I know. Pray for me, guys. But, um... He, he was talking about how the new Pokemon is shit, you know, the, the typical Gen 1 or stuff, you know. And so he was like, man, Pokemon's so bad now. It used to be so good. And I was like, how did it used to be so good? He was like, you know Pokemon Red and Blue? And I was like, e well, yeah, I mean, you, you can't forget about all the wonderful glitches that were in the game also, you know. Like, uneven balancing. And I just named everything that was wrong with Gen 1, and I tore it apart. And just saying, I it's not that I don't like Gen 1, it's this, I don't like Gen 1ers. Now, I like Fire Leaf Green, but we all have to admit, Red and Blue are terrible. Like, we have to admit that. If you, Unless you grew up with it, and you're just playing it for nostalgia purposes, Gen 1 is terrible. 
but Generation 3 Fire Leaf Green, that was amazing. That is a very, very good game. But he's one of the Shin Wonders. He's like, oh, Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire suck. And this guy doesn't even have a 3DS. So, I, I don't know what he's trying to get at, but whatever. So, anyways, the time has come, guys. The time has come for Claire's voice. No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but the time has come for us to finally defeat the gym challenge. After 21 episodes, 22nd episode right now, we are finishing the Johto gym battles. Isn't that crazy? It seems like just yesterday I started this LP. But, you know, all good things gotta end sometime or another. But anyways, let's get this started. <clears throat> I'm Claire! The world's best dragon type master! You know, my only thing is to pull the ones to the lead for it! Do you start to take me on? Fight! Lost on us! It's a challenger! Who has my full power? Because to me, opponent! Okay, so I just think that's how Claire sounds because she seems like a bitch. <laughs> To me, she seems like one. But the, you know what, this battle, I'm not gonna speed it up. I'm gonna keep the suspense. So let's not speed it up. All right, so first slot, she has a Dragonair, and no issues, hopefully. We're gonna use Ice Beam, hope for the best. Come on, Butte, come on, you got this. You got this, baby, you got this. There we go, there we go, Butte, you amazing. You are awesome. I, have, I will never doubt you, ever, I swear, I swear it. <laughs> Okay, so next is the Gyarados, and Gyarados, okay, let's see, what do we have, what do we have, what do we have, um, I would, actually, you know what, oh, uh, no, it can learn Thunderbolt, um, but then if I send in Shield off, he's gonna probably use Surf, crap, I don't know what to do, um, you know what, I'm gonna go for the Stone Edge, hope for the best, let's hope for the best, and speed up. Um, let's hope for the best. Uh, this is... Oh, fuck, I got... No, 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 I got strength. I got strength. Fuck! No, 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 no! No, his earthquake! Oh, my God, I'm so stupid! How did I forget about that? Come on, come on. Your defenses are amazing. I love you, Shield Off. You are the... There you go! There you go, Shield Off! I love you! <laughs> oh, my God. This is hype as crap. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. Oh, what? It has that little... Are you serious? You've got to be kidding me. Okay, well, we're going to use... We're going to use that. Just hope he misses. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my goodness. Oh, my God. Okay, so... Oh, my God. It does so much. Uh, okay, use water. Okay. You know what? I think I might be able to live this. Should I... Should I do it? Should, no, I'm not going to risk it. I'm not risking that. I'm not about to risk that. Okay. Ice beam. Oh, yes, it froze! Yeah! Yeah, baby! Yes! Okay, 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 gotta calm down. Calm it down, calm it down, simmer down. Okay, it's still frozen, it's still frozen. Uh, Dragon Pulse. Awesome, it does even more. Oh my god, oh my goodness, no way. Oh my god, we just, we just beat the Gyarados. We just beat the Gyarados, guys. Okay, Ice Beam. Yeah, yes, it's not, oh, um, I need to stop using the speed up button, okay. A Salamence. Okay, we can do this. We can do this, Butte. You got this. You got this. This thing is slow as crap. You got this, Butte. I believe in you. I 100% believe in you. Butte, you can do this. I believe. I believe in the Milotic. Alright, you can do it. You can do it. You There we go! There we go, Butte! There we go! Are we really gonna make it through? No way. I do not believe this. Are we seriously gonna make it through? I really hope you, I really hope I'm not busting your guys' eardrums, but I am hype as crap right now. I'm so excited. I cannot believe we're about to do this. Are we really about to beat Claire? No way! It gave me so many issues in the past, though. How come? Oh man. Okay. 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 This thing. It knows moves. It knows its shit, man. Okay. I cannot. I cannot screw this up. Please don't let me screw this up. Oh my gosh. Okay, Swagger. Okay. Um, let's use Hyper Potion, because I don't know what it's going to do. Uh, so, yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I, I think we got this. I think we got this in the bag. Do we? Do we have this in the bag? Have we really defeated Claire without losing any Pokemon? No way! We defeated Claire! 
without losing anybody! If I could give you a hug right now, Butte, I would totally give you a hug right now. You know what? I'm gonna hug the computer screen. There we go. Oh my goodness. Do we really just do that without losing anyone? We really just did that with a Mom! I just beat Claire without without anyone dying! Yeah, I know! Okay. <laughs> okay. Alright. So, oh uh, man, I, I still can't believe this. I'm, I'm gonna end up lowering that volume down because I've been screaming for the past like five minutes. I cannot believe we just beat Claire without losing anyone! I cannot believe this. This is insane. I won't concede this. I might have lost, but you're still not ready for the Pokemon League. I know, you should take the Dragon Master Challenge. Behind this gem... Excuse me. Sorry, I had to cough. Behind this gym is a place called Dragon's Den. There's a small shrine in its heart. Go there. If you can prove that you've lost your lazy ideals, I'll admit you're a trainer worthy of a gym badge. Okay. 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 Oh my god. How did we do that? I just beat Claire without losing anyone. How is this possible? What do you guys say, old fay? Hello, this is Professor Oak. You're catching a lot of Pokemon, aren't you? Bitch! The fuck? Are you gonna call me and waste my time just to tell me that? Bitch, I know I've got a lot of Pokemon. I got like 57. Just kidding. <laughs> just kidding. There's not even 57 routes in the game, bro. <laughs> oh my goodness. I cannot believe we just made it through the Elite or through Claire without losing anyone. Without losing anyone. An emphasis on everyone. Or without losing anyone, an emphasis on every on anyone. I cannot believe this. This is insane. So I'm gonna put you right there. Oh man. Oh man. Butte is the MVP right now, guys. You guys have no idea. Butte is the real MVP. I did not even know we were this close to the end of the game until this episode, bruh. <laughs> bruh. I just I still can't believe it. I can't believe it can't believe it, my boys are grown up, so we can get an encounter in Dragon's Den, because there's an event Pokemon in here, so we can go ahead and get an encounter, hopefully it's gonna be something worth our while, please let it be, so, but I am gonna battle these guys right on quick, I'm gonna go ahead and spray my repel, keep it up, ice, ice something, ice beam, right, I hope it is, <laughs> so like, she, Beaut is getting the finest of the XP right now, I don't know why, but Claire just got the finest of work. She just got her booty handed to her, man. They're like, jeez. Jeez, this Christ. Like, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Wow. <laughs> but I, I cannot believe it. So anyways, I'm going to get a Whirlpooler. Because I'm not about to waste a valuable move on Butte's moveset. We have Br Butte has proven herself to not get any more HMs. That, that's just the power of Butte, man. <clears throat> Like, she, she, she doesn't deserve to even, or, no, she doesn't, she doesn't, like, she sh just shouldn't have anything in her moveset right now, because it is perf. It's perf. So, anyways, we're going to cheat Whirlpool to that Clam Pearl we just picked up, or otherwise known as Censored. So, I can remember Censored, but I can't even remember the Pokemon that I have. Like, wow, wow, wow. But anyways, where you're going? Oh, it's already learned. Okay, that's cool with me. All right, let's go. I did not even know I'd already do Whirlpool. That's actually really surprising. I still cannot believe we beat Claire without losing anyone. That is amazing. I don't care what anyone says. I don't care if people say, "Bro, your reaction, calm down." But come on, you're you're telling me you would beat Claire without losing anyone, without even getting a knockout on your side, and you wouldn't freak out about it? You are lying. I'm sorry, but you are a straight liar if if you say that. I'm just saying. There's no way that if you beat Claire without losing anyone, there's no way you wouldn't flip your shit. Like I did, at least. Okay. So, let's keep going. Well, that is if you're doing a Nuzlocke. Oh my god. Oh, I still can't believe it. Um, so censored, use Whirlpool. Awesome. 
and Whirlpool's animation is always slow as crap. So we're gonna get in here, and we're possibly gonna get a dragon near, or a dragon something, a Dratini. There we go. Hmm, good to see you here. No need to explain why you came. Claris in here, didn't she? That girl is a handful in the booty. <laughs> I'm sorry, but I must test you. Not to worry, you are to only answer a few questions. Ready? What are Pokemon to you? Allies. Oh, I understand. What helps you to win battles? Cheating? <laughs> well, I mean, kind of. I have been cheating a little bit throughout the game, but that's only like a minuscule bit. Um, strategy. Oh, I understand. What kind of trainer do you wish to battle? Anyone. Oh, I understand. What is most important for raising Pokemon? It's love. <laughs> oh, I understand. Strong Pokemon, weak Pokemon. Which are which is the most important? Both. Hmm. I'm C. You care deeply for Pokemon. Very commendable. That conviction is what is important. Dan, don't lose that belief. It will see you through at the Pokemon League. Is this clear? So how'd it go? I guess there's no point in asking. Ha! You did fail. Fish what? You passed? That can't be! You're lying! E e even I was- even I haven't been approved! Claire! This child is impeccable in skill and spirit. Admit defeat and comfort- and comfort the rising badge. Or must I inform Lance of this? Yeah. Fuck. Uh, I understand. Here. This is the rising badge. Hurry up, hurry up, fucking take it. <laughs> and we got the last gym badge. Huh, so proud to say that. Oh man. I don't know what I'm gonna do next. The rising badge will enable your Pokemon to use the move for climbing waterfalls. Also, all Pokemon will know you as a trainer and obey your every command without question. Claire, reflect upon what it is that you lack in this child hat. Sorry for that small interruption, guys. I had to pick up my food. But anyways, dot dot dot. By the way, have you heard of Lugia? It is a Pokemon said to have lived around World Islands once. Never mind. Just mad words of the old. So, are you gonna give me stuff? <laughs> By the way, have you heard of... Okay. I don't know. I mean, do I have to come back or something? Here, let me, like, in, let me exit and then come back. Are you gonna give me anything? Nope, I guess not. Dang it. Here, let me go out of the dragon den. Out of the dragon's den. And let's see if that does anything. Um, okay, I guess I have to actually manually go out. I'm gonna get an escape rope on my way. Actually, you know what? It's just a Dratini, you know? Like, it's really not that big of a deal. And if it is, then I'll just end up coming back here in a grinding montage or something. Like, I'll most definitely come back here. But, um, the only thing I can run into here is Magikarp, so there's really no use in getting an encounter. Um, so, yeah. Let's go ahead and... Oh, clear. Wait! I'm sorry about this. Here, take this as my apology. And I think that is Dragon Pulse, if I'm not mistaken. Yep, it is. Okay. And she's just gonna tell us all this stupid crap. And yeah, she's just telling us to go to the Pokemon League now. So that's... Pretty cool, I guess. I'll say, let me fix my microphone. There we go. There we go. Okay, give it your all. And I will give you my number. There will come a time where I'll prevail. And there we go. And so I'm going to leave. Go back out. Your Professor Elm's calling me. Excuse me, I had a cough again. <laughs> Hello, Dan. How's it going? I've gotten hold of us something. Swing by the lab and pick it up. Hmm. I wonder what that is. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. Let's go check it out, though. Before I end the episode, I'm gonna go check that out, because I wonder, I wonder, I wonder what that is. Guess we're about to find out. Alright, what you got, old man? Uh, come on, there we go. Oh, it's Lyra. Dan, did you already collect eight badges? That's so cool. The professor, the professor is waiting for you. Oh, this is the Starbucks girl. I can't exactly do the voice right now. I'm sorry. 
Hi, Dan. You never cease to amaze me. Thanks to you, my research is going great. Take this as a token of... Oh, it's just a Master Ball. Okay. This is in the original game, too. Okay. And, yeah. Okay. There we go. Oh, my gosh. Come on. The Kamara Girls are waiting for you at the Ecritique Dance Theater. So, th that is what I was going to be doing earlier in the episode. But, turns out, it's after you beat the 8th gym. I did not know that. So, anyways, guys, I hope you enjoyed today's episode of the Sacred Gold Nuzlocke and me freaking out half of it. So, yeah. I will see you guys on the next episode, which will cover the Kimono Girls and Ho-Oh. See you on the next episode.